Hi, I'm Chris Cantwell. I'm a graduate student at USC studying quantum computing, and I'm the developer of Quantum Chess, the game you may have recently seen Paul Rudd beat quantum physicist Stephen Hawking at. I'm just calling uh, to challenge you to a game of, uh, of quantum chess. The video was narrated by Keanu Reeves and directed by Alex Winter. And yes, you heard Stephen Hawking call Paul Rudd. Punk. There's no other game where you can interact with quantum phenomena quite the same way. All my life, I was always interested in math and science and technology, but I was also an athlete. I, uh, I made varsity swim team my sophomore year in high school. And then when I was 16, I broke my neck in a diving accident and all of that changed. I didn't let it stop me. I graduated with my friends. In fact, with the help of an assistive device and a friend, I walked across the stage and got a standing ovation, and it was pretty incredible. I've got an amazing support group in my family and friends, and I also now have a beautiful wife. We got married in September, and she has been incredible in this process. She has put so much work into making sure my creation is a success. I had a final project, and the professor for the course suggested I make an app that might help people understand quantum mechanics a little bit better. So I made a little five by five board where the pieces moved around quantum mechanically and it was interesting. It wasn't very fun, but it was cool, I thought. My research advisor was connected with Spiros Michalkis at Caltech and he suggested we get in touch and from there it kind of took on a life of its own. The most common question I find myself answering is, do I need to know quantum mechanics to play quantum chess? And the answer is no. Just like you don't need to know classical mechanics to play pool. My goal with quantum chess was to create a way for people to interact with quantum phenomena so that their brain would develop an intuitive understanding of how these things act. You could write pages that describe how these balls are going to bounce off of each other when you hit them. But you don't need to know all of that to play pool. You just play the game. The game everyone saw in the video is a playable prototype. It works, but it's not pretty, and I wouldn't feel comfortable releasing it to the public. I've set my goal in Kickstarter at $30,000. $30,000 is seed money that will help me hire Broken Circle to get a playable version of the game out there to everyone. The game will have basic networking so you can play with your friends. But there are many stretch goals. Matchmaking system, so as you advance through the game, you're playing against more and more skilled opponents. A lobby system and a chat room so you can talk to people about the game. AI, so there's a single player version. I want apps so you can play on your phone and your tablet. We need your help to be able to do this. Every dollar counts. As you know, Kickstarter is an all or nothing platform. If we don't hit our goal, we don't get any of it. Spread the word, help us get this out there more. It's already been widely received, but the more people that know about it, the better. So join us. This is a unique opportunity. You've never seen anything like this. You get a copy of the game. I can't guarantee Paul Rudd will show up, but who knows? Thank you so much. We can't do this without you. Come on, let's play. Yeah.